A West End football coach admitting that he opened fire during a game between 11 and 12 year olds. His name is Lamont Reagan. He says he pulled the trigger in self-defense, but a well-known community leader says that's ridiculous. WLWT News 5's Todd Dykes covered Reagan's first court appearance today. Todd joins us with what happened. Hi, Todd. I like it. Yeah, the, the judge in this case are two very different stories today. Lamont Reagan turned himself in last night to police after two men suffered gunshot wounds at the end of a youth football game on Sunday. Uh, teams of 11 and 12 year olds from the West End and Evanston battled each other on a field at Walnut Hills High School. Uh, during his arraignment today, Reagan's attorney said the 29 year old fired a gun that he owns when parents from Evanston charged the field. Reagan claims he pulled the trigger to protect himself and his players. That prompted Peterson Mingo, founder of the Evanston Bulldogs, to speak out in court somewhat unexpectedly, saying Reagan's version of events isn't true. He says an Evanston player was attacked when the game ended. Mingo says the player's dad and an Evanston coach ran to help, but ended up getting shot by Lamont Reagan. That young man, he's a coach. How responsible is he? To those kids he coached when they found out he brought a gun to a game you know of kids and even fired the gun I apologize a moment ago if there were some mic issues there but got that figured out reagan had hoped that the judge in this case would give him a fairly low bond in the neighborhood of around thirty thousand dollars uh, judge tyrone yates went with, with two hundred and ten thousand dollars meaning that Lamont Reagan would have to come up with most of that amount in cash if he wants to leave the Justice Center here uh, before a grand jury hears his case at the end of this month. We're now reporting live here in downtown Cincinnati, Todd Dykes, WWT News 5. And Todd, you've done some digging today. Give us some interesting details here you found out about Lamont Reagan. Well, in court today, we learned that he graduated from the University of Cincinnati, where he studied business. This summer, he was recognized by the Cincinnati's Holocaust and Humanity Center for teaching kids in the West End what the center at the time called core values. Mike.